you know what? I would love to know. Because I, um. <laughs> Minnie. Minnie May. Oh, you're so cute. Vicious Terrier. Come here, Cal. That's Kyle's dog right here, Minnie. And this is Calhoun. Come here, Cal. He's a, he's a red tick coon hound. Red. He's a giant dog. Giant dog. Yes, you are a giant dog. Enormous. Okay. He's solid. He's bigger than me. Oof. And your breath smells like. Bleh. This boy here. Get down. Get down. Get down. Get down. Get down. Good boy. Go lay down. I'm sorry to disturb you. He is like food obsessed. Okay. And he uh, ate four loaves of bread yesterday. He got into the cabinet and ate four loaves of bread. Four. They have to lock up all the food. They have to put um, uh, like baby locks on the cabinets so he can't get in there. They have to um, shut, like put a chair up against the... Um, put a chair up against the pantry because he opens up the pantry and he gets in and he eats everything off the bottom two shelves. <laughs> this dog is like oh, food obsessed. Um, anyways, so I'd like to know what happens to the videos that I'll be sitting here recording. I am now recording live via YouTube and um, all of a sudden it just goes back to zero and it's like hey there's nothing like what happens to all I don't know how many videos YouTube has just destroyed and sent out into some far off place and it's just never to be seen again that's why sometimes I don't make videos as frequently as you think because I do but they don't get uploaded and I get frustrated and it's not my computer but I feel like being violent towards it uh, so I just put it away anyways um, good morning it is December 1st and um, I had plans to go somewhere today not really like plans but I was gonna go do stuff today Okay, not really stuff. Okay, I found a new thrift store. <laughs> and I guess there's two in the area. And it's called Stepping Stones Thrift Store. And um, it benefits uh, abused women and children. And um, and the money you know goes towards that to help them and help them find a new place to live and get out of the abusive relationships that they're in and so on and so forth. So, um, but I went there yesterday. I found like, Four shirts, a pair of pants, a shirt, uh, no, 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 four shirts, a pair of pants, um, a purse, and a pair of, like, brand new looking shoes. All for, for uh, $13. $13. Super, super cheap. Okay, and I'm on a budget because I'm unemployed. <laughs> so, this is great for me. But there's another one in the next town over, and I was going to go check that one out today. But, um... I want to show you what's going on out here. Look at this. Can you see that? Yeah. It's pretty and all, but not really what I was looking forward to today. <laughs> um, so it's snowing. Oh, the whole reason why I came on here. Okay, I've already recorded this twice, so I am i don't even remember what I've said in this one and what I haven't. Um, I talked to Dr. Katz in like two days ago because I'm like, hey, man. Okay, I didn't say that. I was like, excuse me, sir. <laughs> uh, I My drain is still putting out 25 to 50 cc's in a 24-hour period. Obviously, that's too much to take out. 
um, what am I doing wrong? I'm doing everything I'm supposed to be doing. I'm doing my iron, doing my protein, doing my fluids, like everything I'm supposed to be doing, and it's just not slowing down. What is the deal? I'm starting to get extremely frustrated because nine weeks and two days is just too long to go without a shower. Sponge baths, like, are really frustrating because they take, like, literally, to take a sponge bath and do my hair, um, wash my hair, it it's like an hour, okay? It just it really shouldn't take that long. Maybe I'm not doing it right. I, I don't know what the heck I'm doing, but... Um, I'm getting frustrated. I want a shower. It's from the Muppets. I saw the Muppet movie on Thanksgiving. Um, Anyway, so he said, well, send me a picture of um, your incision and your drain site, and I'll see if I can approve you for a shower. So I sent it to him kind of late in the afternoon yesterday. He never responded back because um, he, you know, he had a lot of stuff going on yesterday, and, and he's a busy man. He's very, very busy. And nine times out of ten, he responds, like, very, very quickly. Um, but he hadn't responded, um, mostly because I sent him that email, like, by the end of the work day, so maybe he was already gone for the day, I don't know. Anyways, uh, so I sat there, and I waited, and I waited, and I'm like, alright, I'm gonna need to take a sponge bath. I don't want to take a sponge bath, because I'm just, I can't, I can't do it anymore. I'm super, super stinky. <laughs> because it had been a couple of days since my sponge bath because I didn't leave the house. It was just me. Nobody was smelling me and I was just being stinky and lazy and I have no excuses. So I was like, I just really want a shower. So I took a shower. Oh my gosh, the best shower I've had in my entire life. Um, nine weeks and two days post-op, I took a shower, uh, I hope Dr. Katzen doesn't get mad at me, um, but I couldn't take it anymore, I couldn't, I couldn't, I was gonna, I was like, I'm gonna go insane, if I don't take a shower, so I did, I took a shower, and I danced all over the house afterwards, and I put on, uh, after my shower, I put on my, um, body by cats and robe that they give you after surgery and I just danced all over the house and it was magical and I'll remember that moment always <laughs> um anyways it was great so I hope that he's like okay for me taking a shower I'm gonna wait before I take another one um, just because I don't, I don't want to break the rules. I felt guilty the whole time I was in there, but I stood in that shower until all the hot water was gone. I washed my hair like three times and like washing my body was really crazy because, you know, you get into a routine and like before when I had that big thing of skin, it was like, I always had to lift it up and wash underneath it. And, you know, and like I did that, I went to grab it to lift it up in the shower and it was like not there and I'm like wow this is so much easier so much faster and I feel small this is really weird so once the drain comes out I really am excited about taking a shower so uh, just because I won't have that in my way and I can go on about my business if the snow is slowing down maybe I need to get out of here okay anyways this video is too long I'm nine weeks two days post-op nine weeks two three days this is Thursday I don't even know what day it is um doing great hope everybody had a great Thanksgiving mine was wonderful I loved it I love spending time with Kyle's family I seriously love his family like at, like they were my own um so I'm pretty excited about that and uh just had a blast
had a blast. I did, I did good. Uh, really, well, you know, I did as good as I could. I didn't eat a lot of sweets because luckily that day my dumper was actually working. So I ate a little bit of apple crisp that I made and a little bit of ice cream and I had to go upstairs and lay down for like 30 minutes because I was like so sick. So some days my dumper works and some days my dumper doesn't. <laughs> uh, Anyways, hope everybody had a wonderful holiday, and snow has completely stopped, so I am out of here. Uh, I'm also going to figure out something to make Kyle and I for dinner tonight. So, anyways, love you guys. Uh, thank you very much for all of the new subscribers, and uh, find me on Facebook, Sarah Will Be Skinny. Um... Ah! Oh, I better turn this thing off before it goes into Never Never Land. Okay, bye!